Yo, what's good YouTube? Welcome back to my channel and in today's video I'm going to show you my everyday carry or my accessories I take with me on an everyday basis. But before we jump into the video, I do take content like these and if you're into these kind of things, please consider subscribing and turn on post notifications so you'll be the first to get notified whenever I upload a new video. Without further ado, let's jump into the video. So the first thing I always look to grab is my wallet because I keep all my bank cards and credentials basically in here. This is the Lacoste or Lacoste, not sure how that's pronounced. But this is basically made from leather with an alligator on the front of it. This wallet is really strong to be honest. I have this for like almost 5 years and it's still in decent shape. One thing though I have a problem with how thick this thing is when it's folded. And because of that I can't keep this thing in my pocket. So basically this is a part of my bag. So yeah, this is a must have for me on a daily. So the next accessory I always carry is this USB Type-C to PD 4K HDMI adapter. If you own a MacBook, you know Apple only include Type-C ports to their new MacBook. So there's no other way to connect devices to your Mac if it's not a Type-C adapter. And for the price I pay for this, I can say it's pretty solid for only $9. And it's a USB slot, HDMI slot and a Type-C port for extra if you have a lot of Type-C cables. So yeah, this, this is really handy for me. So the other accessory I like to use as well is this Sabran USB hub which can connect up to 4 devices all at once. If I ever need to connect more than just one device I can just use this as an extension with the Type-C hub to get more ports to connect more devices which is always a plus for me. I'm always connecting more than one device because I have more than one iPhone so sometimes I would even max out the ports whenever I'm charging my devices. It also have this blue LED light indicating when a slot is being used and it works perfect. What's accessories without a power bank? And the one I have here is the Easy ACC 26,000 mAh power battery pack which is a must have for me. I'm a person that uses my phone very often and when I'm out and about this always get the job done. You can connect up to 4 devices to this all at once and the best part about this battery pack is the flashlight feature and it also has a smart battery so you don't have to press any button to turn this thing on, it turns on automatically when a device is plugged in, which is great. I literally don't have to charge this thing for like 4 days of use, I easily get through a week of having to charge this battery pack. But the downside is because of such big battery inside this thing it's a pain to juice this pack up but it charges the max speed with two charger overall. I think it's a great battery pack to be honest. Last but not least, I have the 2020 MacBook Air 13 inch. This is the base model. So this is the 8 gig of RAM and 256 gig of internal storage. This is my primary device. I do all editing and work on this here. Some people might say this is for students that's just looking to get some work done. But I have tested and pushed this thing to the limit with some hard 4K exports and it seemed to get the job done in most cases. Other than Final Cut Pro crashes and kick me out of the app. But one thing I really experience with using this is the fun get loud sometimes whenever I'm really stressing this with every work. Otherwise I manage to get things done without any hard issues so yeah. So that's it for today's video hope you all enjoyed this one and if you do smash that like button and if you haven't subscribed already please do so and also remember to hit that notification bell so you stay notified whenever I upload a new video. Also follow me on my social media which I will link down below. Until next time, I will see you guys in the next one. Peace.